hey everybody, it's the 3D Printing Professor. And uh, listen, I'm really, really sorry that I missed Wednesday's uh, upload. That wasn't meant to be a threat with the knife. I'm just letting you know that I, I recognize I missed it. I've been trying to keep a schedule and I'm really sorry that I missed it. But I missed it for a, a lot of good reasons and this video is to tell you about them. But to keep you interested, I'm going to be giving away some of my 3D printed spinners. I think I'll have two or three winners get these spinners uh, when we're done some point in this video I'll stop my my monologue about what's going on in my life and let you know how you, what you need to do to win but you don't know when it's coming so be sure you watch the whole thing hopefully I can keep it entertaining for you okay let's get started so let's start a little bit of background music while I talk to you and uh, so yeah, I recorded a video this uh, this week, and unfortunately, it was the same style as this one, but I was rushed. I have too much going on, and I entirely failed to. Uh, I didn't check my audio. I screwed it up, so that one had to be thrown away, and I just didn't have time to record another one. I'll re-record that video and get it out uh, for you this week. I've been trying really hard to keep a schedule of an upload every Wednesday and every Saturday for you. And I, I'm thinking of shifting that to being uh, maybe Wednesday and and uh, Monday or something like that. Wednesdays tend to be a good day for me to do my uploads. Uh, from the analytics standpoint, the, the videos do better on those days. Um, I want to do them Saturday, but I also want to use Saturday for a new project that I'm working on. So I guess my first announcement is I'm on Twitch. Uh, I have a channel on Twitch and I haven't uploaded anything yet, but it's 3DP Professor. But most likely, I'm going to be using that channel for uh, playing video games uh, with my kids. I play a lot of video games with my kids and they're getting older and they're getting clever and they're saying just the cleverest things uh, as we're playing the video games. And I want to I want to document that and record that and share that with you guys. And so I'm thinking Saturday morning. I used to play Saturday morning video games with my kids. Very cool. Comes with a tool. Uh, and I want to do that again. Did I mention what I've got here? This is uh, this is just something to do uh, while while I'm talking to you about things that are going on. This is an Anet A8 printer, uh, which I got from my friends at GearBest. And if you would like to get one, there's a link in the description. It's an affiliate link, of course. So if you've been thinking about getting an A8 and you want to support my channel, go ahead and click that link and buy it from there. If you see anything else on Gear uh, GearBest, I absolutely love GearBest. I've been working with them for a while. And if you say, hey, can you send me an affiliate link for, for this or that or whatever? Uh, guys, that's the wrong plug. We may have to discuss this. Um, yeah, let me know. I'll set up an affiliate link. Because I've, I've been shopping with GearBest for years. Absolutely love them. Um, so, let's see. What else has been going? Well, you know, the biggest reason why I missed Wednesday's upload is because I have a new baby uh, in my life. And it's, uh, well, you know how babies are. Well, or maybe you don't but it's taking up a lot of my time. And so uh, that's kind of what ruined Wednesday's upload for me. Oh, I could just leave this all in here if they put it all in nice, nice pretty little shelves. I'll just rebox this all while I'm talking to you. Um, what else has been going on? Oh, I, I'm taking part in a number of summer programs for the local 4-H club. So if you are convenient to Southern Utah, Cedar City or St. George, I've got programs on uh, May 30th through June 2nd, which you can see. Uh, let's put that up right there. There we go. It's on the monitor behind me, but there's the monitor behind me. Uh, so I've got uh, things going on then. I've got things going on uh, June 13th through the 15th. Those are both in St. George. Uh, and then I've got some additional ones going on in Cedar City on June 21st, July 10th, and July 14th, and then August 1st through the 3rd also in Cedar City. So that's what I've got going on. These are going to be 3D printing classes where I'm going to be teaching, well I'm kind of focusing it on kids but it'll work for adults too, uh, the basics of operating and, and maintaining a 3D printer. And you know I kind of wish that I were selling 3D printers at these things or that I had the capability of selling them. Uh, because I have a feeling a lot of people after they go through these classes are going to be like, yes, I'm ready to buy a 3D printer. Cool, SD card. Uh, now I have two. And uh, analytics say that only like 10% of you got that joke. So failing the, the jokes already. 
Um, oh, here's the main board. Very cool. Can't wait to put this all together. The display port for it. Ugh, look at this. Just convenient little... I love this packaging. Convenient little ways of organizing things so I don't have to, to make a mess of everything. But I can keep them neat and organized as I, as I build them and work on them. Oh, so cool. I may have to talk to them about the plug situation. We'll see. Um, so yeah, there's all of that. Um, in addition, uh, you know, this month has been absolutely crazy for me for backers. There have been more new backers through Patreon, and I really, really appreciate all of those new backers. Thank you very much. Um, those new backers have enabled this video style. This computer was purchased with, you know, your guys' support, and it's enabling me to just kind of do everything all at once, on the fly, live, and which is what's enabling me to even think about Twitch. Oh, there's the power supply right there, so uh, be careful when doing that, because that is the one part that, if you don't follow the instructions, can seriously harm or possibly kill you, so... <laughs> Not for kids, but um, cool, so cool. Oh, this one's heavy. Ah, it's got the power brick. It's got all the metal rods and everything in it. Goodbye. Don't need you anymore. All right, so let's just lay this out here. And I will probably be working on this. This takes about three hours to put together. So I will probably be working on this all week long as I find the time. Um... You know what, now it's time. It's time to stop and talk about how to earn, uh, how to win a spinner. So I'm going to have a uh, card pop up right here. And that card is to one of my older videos called Which Way Is Z? And it's a good video, but for some reason has never gotten any views. I think it was just put out at a bad time uh, when I didn't have many subscribers. But it's one of my better videos. It's not better videos, but it's a good video. I want you to go watch that video. And I want you to comment on that video about you know, something that happened. It's all, it's all about learning in school. So tell me about an experience you had in school on that video. And then this, the comments on that video will be eligible. And in two weeks when I upload my last 3D printed spinner video, I say last, I should just say my next because these things are just compelling. Uh, when I upload the next one of those videos, I will be giving away people from the comments on that video. So go ahead. Uh, that that card will stay up till the end of the video, so you can just wait until the end of the video, click on the card for which way is Z, watch it, put a comment in there, and there we go. Uh, so talking about the new backers, I want to thank specifically, and I'm, I'm a little bit behind on making the, uh, the uh, uh, supporter tiles. I will get those out soon. Uh, Marco Eberman, Jason Baker, Ashton Christian, David Mueller, I think is already up there. Uh, Darren David Clark, Hans Bert, uh, Brad Stanner Mueller, I apologize if I'm massacring your names, Niels Weilers, Matthew Johnson, Brian Williams, Bob Hager, uh, Mende Najav, and uh, the, the last one, this, this cool little tile right here, is for the forgotten 3D printers. An anonymous donor wanted me to take up this cause, and you know what? I want to take up this cause, the forgotten 3D printers. 3D printers who people bought... <laughs> spent some time putting together or maybe they never finished putting them together and they're they're forgotten and there are a lot of them out there i've encountered them you've encountered them and it's a cause that at some point i'm going to make a video about and and make a call to if if i were doing it properly if i were really making it work i would do something like like uh, uh offer to buy these printers and put them in other people's homes uh and i wish that i had the capital for doing that uh, I don't yet, but who knows, maybe we can make that happen. So I'm exploring the forgotten 3D printer, so look forward to that. Also, I have um, a new book coming. I'm going to take 3D Printing 101, I'm going to put it on Amazon. So that's coming, that's also driving me crazy. Uh, I, I ran into some problem with, some, with my uh, YouTube affiliates. I signed up with a YouTube affiliate because I wanted to, uh, I wanted to have the benefits of affiliation, uh, but then they went and put unskippable ads at the beginning of all of my videos and that was that was frustrating and that caused me to lose subscribers and lose views and things just kind of dropped off at, at a critical time 
for me. And I'm counting the cost now and saying, do I really need to have an affiliate? And I, really, I don't want it. I got an affiliation because I didn't want to have to deal with this stuff. And now it's something else that I have to deal with. So put in the comments your thoughts on if you have any thoughts about YouTube affiliates and people who are affiliated with programs. Uh, you know, the best, the top YouTube channel out there, Tom Salander, who absolutely deserves to be in the top spot. He makes fantastic videos. He's unaffiliated and he's doing fine, but just about everybody else underneath him has an affiliate. And I don't know. I, I'm, I'm between it. I'm not sure whether I should keep this up or not. Uh, but I don't want to end on a, on a negative note, so I do want to tell you about what's been happening with the game of Ur. You can see that I printed my Ur board here. Uh, I have to keep a rubber band around this one. The newer ones that I'm making, which I am making a lot of, uh, they close much nicer and I fixed the latch on them. But this was my prototype and the latch isn't fixed on it. But, uh, oops, open it the wrong direction. I've got little rules for it. I've got, uh, I painted this one with nail polish and it looks absolutely fantastic, absolutely love it. Uh, let me pull up my second screen and switch to the next tab on it. Uh, oh, I forgot about the St. George Board Game Convention. I'll come back to that. Uh, but you can actually buy, not this board, the, the color one is up there just to demonstrate what it looks like. What you would buy looks more like that without the, the robot chess sets on it. Um, but I put these up for sale on Etsy. Uh, and I did this in collaboration with Robert Ingson, who made the design on the board that I used, and he's selling them as well. So I will have links to both my listing and his listing. If you're in the UK, order from him. If you're in the US, you can order from me. Um, we did this for a very good reason, and next Saturday, I will be having a live stream interview with him talking about why we did this and what happened. It's a fascinating story. I was so excited when I heard about what was happening, which was bad, because what was happening to him was kind of frustrating and, and disappointing but when he heard it I was like don't do anything let me talk to you first and we we hashed out a conversation and and this is the result of it and we'll tell you why next Saturday so I hope you'll tune in and check that out because it's so cool and so fascinating and really uh, uh, really I think a situation came up and this was the best way to handle it just stay tuned for that next Saturday uh, yeah St. George board game convention uh, let me go pop over to that one, uh, is happening in August, and it's looking like I'm going to be there as well, and I'm going to have my my uh, ur boards and chess bots and whatever else I can bring to, to participate in that. It's going to be a lot of fun. So again, if you're in Southern Utah, and St. George is, you know, just a couple hours away from Vegas, so uh, if you guys are convenient to that area you can come and just you know maybe go up to zion's and make a weekend of it after after saying hi to me at the convention if not uh, uh either way it's fine but i wanted to let you know that that was happening in august as well so all these things have kind of come up at the same time and it's, it's kind of making me really busy but i still am dedicated to getting you guys great content you guys like my uh makerbot what's the deal with makerbot video so i will hopefully be doing more of these sort of stories about 3d printing in the future um next saturday is going to be a great one also my son made a new board game project so there will be a new video for that i'm not short on video ideas if anything i've got more than enough to do uh just need the time to do it and get everything else going on uh i i would love to do a video of making this i would love to live stream the making of this but i don't know if i can dedicate the the three hours on a twitch live stream to build this 3d printer uh, interactively with you guys so for now I'm just gonna put it together and a review for this will be coming soon um, but this is also necessitating another project because I don't have room in here for another 3d printer so I'm gonna have to run power out to my shed uh, and, which I've been wanting to do but now it's necessary because I've got some other 3d printers coming in uh, so yeah that's another project that's gonna make it difficult for me to uh, put videos out in a timely manner, but I'm dedicated. I'm going to make this work for you guys. I'm really sorry I missed Saturday or Wednesday. I'll make it happen again, but Wednesday and Saturday you can expect videos from me from now on. I promise as best I can. Anyways, I thank you guys very much for watching. As usual, safety first. Go check out the other video, and I will see you next time.